fucking mask with this fucking podcast. That shit is gay. You're not going that way. Get your dumb ass. He don't pay attention. He don't listen to the host of the podcast. He just want to be on it. He don't even want to be on it, though. See what I'm saying? See why niggas get, um... All right, let me restart that. I'm going to restart it. Life's a bitch. Plain I know that. Stop right here, it's restarted, nigga. Last car came in the fucking building, round up again. In the building, building. we outside with it. We always inside when we outside. They doing construction, niggas can't hear us. You always gonna repeat yourself. Every episode, you're gonna do the same episode over and over again. I know that's you, NASCAR. You say the same shit every fucking day. You got no innovation in your words. All you do is say, I'm not gonna fuck with no bitches. Then you be fucking with bitches. Then you're not gonna fuck with no bitches. Then you fuck with bitches. Then you do keep fucking with bitches. And then the same shit happen that make you realize you need to stop fucking with bitches. Then you keep fucking with bitches. That's why I stop saying that shit. What? That's why I say. I can't hear you, NASCAR. Sounds like you capping. I hear all cap. Sound like the cabin. I be having blue sleep problems. That's why. That's why I be feeling like that. Not blue sleep problems. It's just like, bro. I be all over the fucking place, bro. You smell like it. Cause life's a bitch and then you die That's why he gets high Because he ain't really that fucking fly And then he tries to rhyme like I But he cannot Because he ain't died three times See what I'm saying? Y'all ain't ready for this episode This is the episode where NASCAR show you how ugly he is You see, you guys see What's real? You already see where yeah, this see. joint starting yeah, at. It's starting off facts only. Like this episode is starting off facts only. Like it's the hardest, hardest episode. It's all facts only. I think I was supposed to be ugly to me. I ain't say you was ugly to me. I just said you was ugly. It's just a fact. This is what you are. Some people are what they are. I told you, mm-hmm. like I said before, if I was ugly, I had bitches. See what I'm saying? He's going to do the same podcast today. Same episode. Episode same. 7 is the same as episode 8. So don't even tune into the pod. It's going to be the same shit. Funny. Fucking with NASCAR is the same shit. Where your phone at? You got the... This nigga done left the list. I'm sick of this nigga, man. I was looking for the list. I was going to tell you when you was listening to the podcast. You need to text message me. And when I airdropped you the list man, at I'm work. Looking, I'm looking where my shit is at and it's not there, bro. See what I'm saying? What I tell you? Niggas, bro. That's why you don't fuck with DMV niggas, bro. Oh, that's why I fuck with you. Fuck with DMV. This is why you, you know, everybody know. DMV niggas be on sports. But nah, y'all should have just t- said fuck all that shit. I'm about to just ask you to send this shit. And she was like, you, I said to some other idea. idea. So you gonna walk in front of me. I guess I'm gonna just be on the camera. Dude. Huh? Nothing. Funny, bro. I'm not gonna break my wrist trying to put you on the camera. Put your ugly ass. 
walking fast as shit, and we got a whole blunt to finish. Stop yeah, nigga, where, nigga? All right, let me see. Cause life's a bitch and then you die. Think we can pod on this one. We can pod right here. We can pod on the block, on the corner, on the street, on the street, on the block, on the corner, on the block, on the street, on the corner, on the block, on the street, on the corner. Cause the block on the street with the we can pod right there on the block, on the corner, on the street, on the block, on the corner of the block, on the street. See what I'm saying? On the bon- on the border, on the border of the block of the bleed. Uh, my brothers, what's up, my brothers and sisters? Hello, my brothers and sisters. It's fucking popping, man. I was about to say the same shit. Look, I don't even chill. fuck that shit. Look, I don't even know where the camera at, but look. Oh, there you don't like know that. where the camera is at? Oh, that shit's smaller. Shit, I'm trying to look in the camera, bro. Yeah, scoot to the right. That's, this nigga scooted right? back. I said scoot to the right, and this nigga scooted this back. Some wild shit. How I do some wild shit? I said scoot to the right. You scoot oh, it back. Oh, oh. Nigga, oh, this is on some other shit. Oh, no, bro. Look at him, pull up. Top up. Oh, no. Smoking? Yeah. Yeah, I bet, right. I bet. Can't smoke out here in front of the cameras. God damn. Let's migrate. Let's migrate. As soon as we, as soon as we got the set set. Soon as we got the set set. See what I'm saying, bro? You playing games? I'm not gonna keep putting this chop with his ass on the camera. Yeah, right. he said he not trying to be on the camera, y'all. He said he know he ugly. He said he know he ugly. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta walk in the camera, bro. Mm. Popping man. It's your boy NASCAR fucking piece right now. This nigga. Yeah. Alright. That's that that's that's what you need to do. Woof. That's what you need to do. When one of them bike niggas ride by. What? That's what you need to do when one of them bike niggas ride by with that music playing. This nigga retarded. This nigga, bro. Perfect. Perfect fucking thing to do. All right. Oh, this funny as shit. All right. Not that funny. They be on it out here, there, bro. They don't be dealing with no fucking people. That's, that's, that's the thing right now. Look, how was your month and a half out here? Out here where? I'm not dropping locations. You're not dropping locations. You're in San Diego, California. Everybody <laughs> knows that. Okay. This nigga, talking about he's not dropping no. I didn't ask for mall on my podcast. This is not the Joe Button Hi. show. This is the Rondo show. How you feel about San Diego? This nigga chose to be too cool for this show. Hey, this look, this looks like my first show. So 
what you say? Don't you love when niggas is new to the production shit? Niggas no, is just, new to the production. No, no I, I, get, I get this. I get this. I get it. I understand it. I'm burnt out. But I'm burnt out. Because you're from the DMV. My fuck. Yeah, that's why I just dropped that shit because I'm from there. But I'm a new nigga. It's a Bernard. As soon as I get to faking like you knew, okay. pushing you out on the edge, pause. That's when karma strike me. See what I'm saying? Expose me for who I am. Go a new nigga to the production shit. I don't really like being on camera. I'm new to this shit. I ain't really like being on camera. I don't be on this shit. It's something they be too cool uh, shit. I'm too cool for everything, nigga. I'm too cool for you, nigga. I'm too cool for your boo. I still smashed that. Still fuck. I told you. Still got my dick sucked. I told you. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. Yabba dabba doo. Woo. I told somebody today. You gotta speak up. I told somebody today. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's why I'm Yeah, nigga, but you not gonna do that, so. Until then, no, we gotta talk. I wanna do that. Uh, you know, it's a step, it's step process. That's what I'm saying. It's not gonna happen this second. Maybe. I know, yeah. But we're talking about mics. Production. I talked to somebody today, and I said, I love. Wait, what? It's still recording. What you love, you fucking weirdo. Bro. I love being a DMV dude, like a DMV nigga, bro. Oh. I said I love being a DMV nigga, bro. I don't like being in a DMV around other DMV niggas. Because everybody in competition is see who more of a DMV nigga than the other. Uh, that shit crazy, bro. I don't give a fuck about where nobody from, bro. I'm who I am, and how I deal with people is none of y'all niggas is worth worthy. And none of y'all niggas is, is real. None of y'all niggas is nice. And none of y'all people can be trusted. But at the same time, this is a, the same way I treat you. I love you to death. Every fucking body. So that's just how it goes. So that's the conundrum that I gotta live with. And I understand it. And I'm free through spirit. I don't live on this energy. I be living in synergy. Yeah. Facts. Oh, this shit. Who goes there? Is it a bitch name? Uh, oh, it's a rich name. It's not true that all. What? The chosen one? Nigga say. That's the thing. Anybody can be a chosen you smell like a chosen one. You look like a chosen one. Like you chose one. And you was the one chosen on First Street. Oh, God. You was the First Street. You know this first street first nigga on First Street. That's <laughs> you my son on First Street. Anyway. Don't face That's the inside joke. I don't know nothing about First Street. Say this shit look like first street. Oh, smell like it, bruh. Keep talking all day. You the biggest talker. Always talking about you don't drop no location. You don't drop location, but he'll tell a bitch his whole life story. This nigga. Explain that. Explain that logic. 
Yeah. Tell a bitch everything you've been through. Rely on her to get from I'm work. Lying. I'm just, it's well, like ain't something lying. Something that, well, well, ain't lying. lying. No, it's just it's a conversation. <laughs> like we have a conversation. Yeah, a conversation. I'm just telling all my personal business. It's something. I mean, ain't really personal business. But I ain't gonna tell the podcast like, that yeah. I'm in San Diego, California. You already told me. Well, being funny, bro. You ain't being funny. You was dead ass serious until you realized. Oh, what? I you tried to funny, be funny bro. after that. What? I'm trying to be funny, bro. What? That's the captain ass voice. What? That's the captain ass voice. That's the captain tone. I guess. I'm high, bro, so you won't get it. Man, you get all the smoke you tonight. Loud and wrong. That's your crazy. Loud and wrong? That's I'm not even loud. Damn. You like, oh, oh, loud, not literally. You talking about what? You talking about what? You talking about what? Not literally. Shut up. Smoke the blunt. I'm gonna hear a nigga talk no more, man. I'm done. Loud. This is the Rondo loud. show. You're not about to do this. Fuck all of that. Loud and wrong. I think I can never be wrong in this show, nigga. Uh-huh. Everything I say on this bitch is fucking beautiful. Everything I say is perfect, correct facts. I dare somebody curate that. Curate my nuts. That's called castration, bitch. And not castration with masturbation, bitch. I mix the same. I mean, I can't doubt. I mean, I love death. I mean, I love pain. I mean, I'm on everything. What y'all want? Who on here? That's what they can say when they older and they new to the phone. They say, who on, who on here? You be like, nigga, this is video. Who on here? This is a FaceTime. Is this a phone call? We are recording the podcast, sir. If you want to interrupt, you can gladly do so. And if you don't want to interrupt, you're okay. We're recording the podcast right now, and you, we are streaming live, sir. You said I can't smoke? Oh, yeah, because we behind here, bro. This is the patio, bro. Even after hours? He don't even care, bro. Look at his little bitch ass. You a bitch. You the biggest bitch. You always want to talk about you don't care about this, that, and the third. You, you the first nigga to run when somebody get upset with you. I'm not running, bro. That nigga's not gonna do nothing. He's not gonna do anything to you, bro. He's just out here. I'm not talking to you about you, nigga. You always think about you, nigga. This nigga. Nigga, that's a, that's a general statement. He's not gonna do nothing to you. It's a general statement. But you sped walk out of from around that corner, nigga, nigga. So that nigga, he ain't even say nothing. He's like, oh, let me get out of here. Because I don't got time. Nigga, what? Time for what? Time for him to not do nothing to you? This, that shit don't make no sense. But this is my point. Niggas say they don't care, but they care. And that's my point every day on this podcast. And it's going. my point is going to forever prove that this nigga that cares about a lot of shit in life. NASCAR P cares about a lot of shit he say he don't care about because he can't help it he struggled with the same shit we all struggle with we all love this shit we all love this dumb shit we all love the bullshit every now and then and it's because we use it we use this shit because we need to fucking level up without the bullshit how the fuck would we be beautiful how the fuck will we be beautiful? Who knows? Palm trees or some shit. Niggas ain't never walked around. What do you think of, what you wanna to say to all the people that see you right now that's hating that you in California? What was the second part? I want to say hello. I want to say I'm sorry that you cannot build up the 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 strength to chase your dreams and go for what you're trying to go for. I hope that watching this journey that I embark on can inspire you 
to manifest your dreams as well and travel to whatever you need to to do so. Somebody some shit to me. You know what I'm saying? Or you doing something, I know the real reason why you're doing it. You know what I'm saying? What's the real reason? Insecurity, bro. It's always the reason, bro. You fucking hating, bro. Shit, blow me off, bro. That's what I mean about be yourself. I just love that shit. I just love when people be mad, bro. Because they're not really mad at me. I'm talking about haters. I love haters. They're the best fans. They're the best everybody. they honestly the realest people because there's other people who feel like that and they smile in your face. <laughs> No, but they really be fucking with you, though. That's the thing. Both of them be fucking with you. Everybody really fuck with you. That's the thing. They all fuck with you. You won't hate on something. You don't even hate on nothing that you don't like uh-huh. or that you think is dope. They got the potential to be or some shit that's popping or some shit that don't got people fucking with it. You know what I mean? Why else would you hate on it? You feel like it's getting more looks than it deserves. That's what it is. That's the only reason you hating. Cause you fucking love that shit. You know that shit lit. You already, you the moment you start hating, you already acknowledging the fact that this shit is fire. Uh-huh. And now you talking about fire right now. You trying to judge fire. Shut your shit up. Just shut, just shut the shit up. But at the same time, it's love, so I can't really say nothing. Like, how stupid that is. It's different styles of hating. That's that's stupid that love and hate is the same shit. That's the worst shit. Because a motherfucker could do some shit, but they really love you. Uh-huh. And it's like, damn, you in the way, but you really love me. Like, yeah. and that's making you be in the way. Like, what the fuck? How you get out of here? Like, I don't want to tell a motherfucker stop loving you. But at the same time, do you really love me if you in the way? Like, what the fuck like, going? got to tell you that shit, bro. They don't really like. They, they don't really love you like that. I don't, think. I don't even know what that love shit is, bro. That should be weird, bro. I think that should be like a scam and shit. Like, it's a lot of shit out here that was here before I got here, and I feel like it's just the fuck niggas up that's new to this game and shit. <laughs> <laughs> it's just the fuck niggas up. That's new and shit to the game. This fucking phone about to die anyway. The world is wild. The world is wild. It's the wild, wild west out here. I know it. 
These niggas be talking, I ain't even walking, I ain't even rocking, la 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 walking. Crazy. Ah, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Oh shit. Ah, ah, ah. Dude, this nigga crazy. Look, look at him, he's wild. Look, man. We the realest niggas outside. Since. Oh, I think kids. I, mean, I think. Nigga, that's crazy that kids more realer than adults. This shit is weird as fuck, bro. That's why I'm made kid creators, because I only want you to create from that place. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. That's the most un that's the most pure place. And it's crazy. Man, this that stuff shit, that society shit, bro, that is dumb ass shit, bro. That don't matter, that's two things made up. I said shit about that. Man. What's gonna help people get out of it? Or what? Or, or, or does it even matter to you if people get out of it or not? I know they. I know that they might get out of it because most people are waking up. So I feel like they're gonna start, like I say, and fuck itself because they know what's real. Just like how we know what's real. You can see that shit. It's crazy. I could, I could see a person. But what's stopping that? people from being they self right now? Anxiety. Fear, 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 fear. I think people don't have, shouldn't have an issue doing something that they know is better for them. What is the real issue? What the fuck is going on? What is fear though? Fear of hmm. it could be fear anything, fear of anything. But what is fear? Oh yo, it's made up. It's not nothing. Fear is anything? It's not nothing, bro. So fear doesn't help at all. It's not nothing, bro. I think fear helped a little bit. I think it lets you know that there's something here that can Oh, 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 I see, I see what you, how you're looking at it. That can that's why I, I see how you're potentially at it. That's harm you. But if you then translate that into panic and dysfunction and just... I'm about to just wild out in the name of trying to be, I don't know, survival. On some just stupid shit, just wilding out. And that's just, like I said, most niggas shooting out of fear, they always end up killing kids and shit. You know what I mean? He's not, he not, he not aiming right, bro. <laughs> you, you scared of shit. Shit. You know what I mean? You're freaking shaking. Everybody understanding that. Like I said, in the world where everything can be cool, so. You wanna hear me? You smell like this day and age. It's funny as hell, cause you definitely smell like this day and age. This day and age. This is why I don't fuck with NASCAR P. Cause he is a B I T C H. You know what I see? Bitch ass nigga is all I see when I see their name. NASCAR. Hating on a nigga. Same as love. So <laughs> don't get mad when I'm <laughs> Yeah, that shit. <laughs> nigga say. Hate is love, so um, can't get mad when I'm hating on you. You gotta just love it. Understand that I'm fucking with you for real. Understand, my brother.
that I fucks with you. My boy. Boy. Yeah. Fuck your choice too, Wasn't talking to you. Don't fuck with you. You want to talk about it? Talk about what? Your Adderall experience, nigga. Don't be fucking basing at me like that. Talk, talk about what? No, I thought you was just... Nigga, you on the podcast. Talk about what? Don't ever talk about, about what me like that. Because I thought... The fuck I do to you, oh, nigga? First off, no, 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 no. This no, nigga no. just went oh, off. First off... What the hell I do? Listen. I, I did. Yeah, I apologize. <laughs> he tired of shit and get mad at me. What the fuck I do? Nah. Uh, because I thought that you said that because I like looked like I was had something on my mind or something. Did you got something on your mind? What you nah. want to talk about? No, I'm right. saying here chilling. All right. But nah, that shit was crazy. Like I want you to explain since I never got to do. It. Of course, I'm about to y'all let me do what I do. But yeah, I'm still on this shit. Like this shit crazy, bro. Like I don't, I feel like I don't want to go to sleep. But nah, this this how it started, bro. First off, look, oh, I gotta say this. I gotta say this, bro. You ever seen a nigga do some, like, try so hard not to do some hot shit that they doing hot shit? Of course. Bro. Everybody been that nigga, too. <laughs> that shit funny, bro. He did it twice, bro. He was trying so hard not to be hot trying to get me a drink that he was looking hot. <laughs> And you look like you was off work. So, yeah, I, I do I do this shit. And I go with my break. Dollar Tree. Mm -hmm. I go with this Dollar Tree. Almost get hit by a car. Fuck. Like, because wow. I, I was listening to music, cranking the music, bruh. And I'm changing the song while I'm in the middle Fuck. of the street. Dumbass nigga. But no, but just the thing, he old as shit, but he seen me, bro. Like, he couldn't stop, bro. Who's gonna stop? He's a white old man. I ain't gonna say it. But. He teach you a lesson. Then, it's crazy because he go park and go in the same store I'm gonna go in. Oh, yeah, he wasn't even about to go nowhere, so he just saw that. Chose to follow you. Uh, I'm going there, come go on the Dollar Tree, come off the Dollar Tree, go walk back across the street, go to work, go back, go back here, go back in the drink. This is a store. It's, it's, it's in San Diego mostly. No, it's it's in San Diego mostly. I, but I don't know where else it would be. I don't know. I, I ain't heard of that shit until I started this job. But. Yeah. We take orders that the customers put in because now you can get groceries from the grocery store that we work at on DoorDash. So now we, we just basically just do Instacart. If you know what Instacart is, is what I'm about to say, right? Explain right now. <laughs> I knew he was going to say something. Bro. <laughs> but listen though. Yeah. Boom. Accept the order. Ghost, you got a scanner on the phone. You get a phone. Your own like phone that you can't you can't take it home. It's their phone, but for the day you clock in and do all your shit on the phone. You got the scanner on the uh, the DoorDash app. You scan the food that the fucking customer orders. Nigga, don't nobody want to hear all that shit. Boom. Nigga, boom. We buy the groceries. We put put them in the bag and put them yeah and give in the, the car door, with the DoorDash door and they drive it to the people. Nigga. Basically, yeah, I was about to do that. Yeah. I'm too dramatic, bro. That's what I'm saying. You the main one talking about you. When I'm talking to you about it, I'm like, yo, I want I want you to do this podcast with nah, this nigga. Get to I mean, myself. I ain't, gonna I, I ain't really going. I ain't really going over there. I'm about to be uh nah, real loosey goosey. I ain't really putting that nothing to nothing. Nah, 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 nah. And I said, okay. And then this nigga get the same. All right, I'm gonna let it build up. And then he said. Then you just said. But that's not. Then, that's, then you just said. I, I, that's how I feel. That's then you not just what said, I'm thinking. dramatic. That's how I feel. That's not what I'm thinking. I, I don't do shit with my brain, but I do shit with my heart and my feeling, bro. That's what I felt like doing. I don't know like what that. You're about. I'm just saying. Anyway, I'm saying all of that is just funny. 
But nah, you you just explain. Everybody do the same shit on podcast. And they, they think they're gonna do something different before they get on and then they do it they just everybody do the same thing until they find each other. I mean, I'm doing whatever I feel like doing, that's what I'm trying to get you to understand, but that's how it's coming out. Until they find themselves on the podcast and just take time. I say I say my true feelings. Yeah, I say how I feel like it's supposed to go. But, hey, but that's look, what you're supposed to do. But now nah, like you just explained it, basically. So <laughs> Yeah, I start. But anyway, so so you took the first order. Took the first order, like three orders. This nigga say, bro, <laughs> the manager, it's our manager. Um, he say, bro, we got fucking five orders. This is how you talk, bro. He be like, yo, we got fucking five orders. <laughs> Like, well, we got fucking five orders, bro. Like, and one is a 21 count. This, bro, that, this nigga, bro. Real live, the, the nigga that ordered the, one of the groceries. Somebody that ordered the grocery. And he ordered, like, 21 things, bro. Most of it, it was shit that the store did not have, bro. And that was the main problem with it being so busy how it was today. Because most of the shit niggas was ordering is either out of stock. Or they don't have the shit no more. Yeah, and then y'all niggas don't even fucking accept that shit quick enough. That nigga just be still trying to find the shit. I hate when niggas do that. Nigga, it's not here, bro. You know what's crazy? Just you said that, but today was a whole different nigga, bro. He was shot. He was getting on me for doing that. <laughs> but on God, I, he, he like, bro, you can't be, you can't spend so much time in one order if you can't see, if you, they don't have it. And just like skewer, because we got to know what I'm saying. I don't never be doing that. Yeah, I, be, I mean, I always noticed that. That's shit. I was like, but he was t- he was saying this to me after work. He said, "Man, me, you are the only people probably that can is built for doing that shit, and it being so busy like that. <laughs> like we we like we the freaked out. That's what he said, bro. He said, bro, bro, I'll be like, oh my god, like, <laughs> like oh my god, like no. Bro, he he dead ass said that, bro. He was like. I feel like she would just be freaked out and like not know what to do. Well, not not know what to do, but like it's too much. Like it's too much pressure. She'd be overwhelmed, bro. But it was be spazzing. I'm telling you, it was clutch time in there, bro. Like he said, clutch time. I was, bro. We was the only. You gotta one. understand though, bro. I did 22 orders. Uh huh. It didn't feel like that much, bro. Cause and then when I hear 44, it don't sound like that much either. It sound like what. Because the job alone isn't like I'm lifting boxes or nothing. It ain't like I'm. But I understand the anxiety that could get like the end, like the speed and the fucking the pressure that that shit is. Bro. That shit is some bullshit, bro. But not the because then some more shit come in. Some more shit come in. And then you got niggas waiting for you. Bro. And then you got. We ain't sat down for like a whole three hours, bro. Like, and really, bro? And if we did sit down, it was like as soon as we sat down, three minutes go by, boom! Oh, we got another order, man, and it's a big one, or it's a little, you know what I'm saying? But some of them, were, like, it was, it was times where it was little orders coming in, like three, like five, three joints, or five, one joint. So like that was, we was cooling on that shit. But like, but not to mention, I'm on six, and I'm like really into this shit, bro. Like I'm like. Oh, That's what I was thinking too. I was like, is it just. Is maybe the time different to you on that shit or something? Or it's like. It's, no, it's. You got, the, you got the energy for everything, but don't nothing like phase you, but like you so focused. Like, you like. That, that doesn't matter to me. Like, I'm doing something. You like that, bro. And then you got so much energy. It's like, bro, you can't help but you want to just do something. Like, you don't want to just sit there. And if you just want to sit there, you want to like do something like listen to some music or do some. Listen to something, so you know what I'm saying. Listen to a podcast, a video, you know what I'm saying. But that's crazy. But now, nah, so we doing the shit, and yeah, we had the 21, we had the 21 order joint, and then well, damn, I'm trying to think. Oh, yeah, he said. I- would have been freaking out and Noel, he don't know, uh, like, he, he don't know about Noel. He, he probably be pulling on it. Like, Noel be good because 
No, we don't do it like third baseman. Uh, he good at he good when you show him the list. He picked like the shit on the other side of the store. Yeah, uh -huh. go get it. Ben be doing that shit too. Yeah, but and the good thing about Noel, he'll come back with two items. Yeah, it's back. Yeah, and be sure two are the same thing or something, or two versions of the same thing to be sure that he got the right one. Ah, uh, that's a fact, bro. So it's drippy having a nigga went through that thing ahead like that. Facts. And yeah. it'd be better with three people. We the best team. Facts. Now I, I gotta feel like now after today, I got a feel of what the fuck is going like where everything at. Mm -hmm. But back to this um the Addy story. <coughs> but so I said Addy story, the feel how it make, how it's making me feel at this point. So now Bro. Like, so how long you been on it? For, for what? For four hours. You still? And, and I drank a Red Bull this morning before I took that shit. But I ain't washed it down with Red Bull. I washed it down with vitamin water. And that joint said some shit about having focus on it or some shit. You smell like it. <laughs> Bro. So, now I'm like... When we finally get like some time to like actually rest and shit, you know like that, <laughs> like time to rest. Yeah, you was tired, boy. No, bro, I was up, bro. That's what I'm saying. Oh, oh, you talking, talking about, about tired? Oh. Well, not get some rest, but like take, like sit down or some shit. You know what I'm saying? Not have an order. Well, I, I was playing him my music and shit. I was listening to my music, then I, I said, oh, I'm, I got to play my music. And I played him the, the fucking Nicki Minaj joint. He said, fuck with that shit. He, he critiqued my music. He tried he critiqued my song. He said, and Kate, you know the song? I got all this cake, I got all this rock. He said, it's a part in there that he don't fuck with. Like, the it's a sound that I put in there. What? The, it's, it go like... <clears throat> Like it's like an explosion. I feel like it was that part. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah and that, that, when he said that, I said, "Bro, I, I was thinking about that when I'm listening to the song." But I was like, I can't edit the song right now because I got my laptop fixed. So I'm like, "Fuck!" I just enjoy enjoy it with the shit on it. But when I get my laptop fixed, I'm taking that out. Like, but so yeah, he was. But that's the same struggle that yeah you be in with this with this music shit wow. it's like we don't reach the point musically where it's like money is the only next beat I can really make like shit like shit bro and it's like when I when I when people start listening to my shit cause I don't even be thinking about that shit because I be enjoying my own shit. I be enjoying all well, That's what I'm saying. I'm good listening to my shit, too. That's what I'm saying. But the, the thought, like, we got to put it out there because we do want people to see the shit. And as far as furthering it, uh -huh. before I put it out, that shit takes so much time and money. Yeah. That's why it's like, you start to think, how much time is it going to take? I should just put it out without the money. Who knows, man? Like shit. Who knows but you, honestly? Facts. Is your shit a hit? And if it's not a hit, is it a good enough song for niggas to respect it? Who knows? Because I feel like my shit is always a good enough song. Niggas yeah. still don't respect it. I don't think niggas respect good songs for real. So I don't really mind. It ain't even that. It's not even that. We just got to just keep being consistent with putting the shit out there. But that's what I'm saying. It's like eventually, I know later. I'm talking about right oh, now, though. Yeah. It's like I'm speaking a different language right now. It's like... And I understand what you're saying because you just don't fuck with shit until it's popping. Yeah, it's like... It don't look right right now. Yeah. I don't have all the pieces to the shit that makes sense right now. And it sound fucked now, up. No, because like imagine like if you had a whole bunch of... I'm saying to me, of course. Oh, yeah, yeah. But it's like... Like you got more than the average listener for me to make sense to you. Because you know me. Uh-huh. So when you hear a song, it's like, damn. Then he did that. 
But for somebody, they starting at the song. So they judging the shit out of me. You see what I'm saying? Ain't no, it ain't relentless. It ain't no fucking, oh, you had the gall, the balls, the nerve to fucking start a podcast, a show, nigga. Who are you? You know what I mean? They critics off top. That's you see what I'm saying? It's like you putting yourself out there, so it's like because they hating, bro. They can't it ain't just them. hating though. It's just the fact that you putting yourself out there is something that everybody don't do. Because most people, some people, most people feel like they can't do shit. But everybody can't do it either, though. Because how the cameraman gonna want to be in front of the camera? Only reason why people can't do it is because. Cameraman can be in front of the camera when he not behind it. Can't um, do both at the same time. You can't own it. You can't do both at the same time. You can't shoot something and oh. be on the camera. I thought you were speaking metaphorically. I ain't gonna shoot my movie and be in it. Nigga. You know you? Like shit. You better shoot that shit. <laughs> it's, like, it's like snow in the bluff. <laughs> Doing the most, bro. He got the camera talking behind that drink, but he wanna film his shit. Don't you ever turn the camera around. If anything, cut it. Please cut it. Please make it cut. Bro. To the next scene. Don't 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 spin the, don't manually turn the camera with your hand. Nice dude. And do this with your neck and nice chin. Dude. Do this. They say but that shit tra- tragic. Hell is tragic. Hell is tragic. Anything is tragic. Fuck it's just hell. Bro. I still I ain't gonna say anything is tragic, no it's mm, I am on a different mindset now, like that it it ain't even it's not even that anything tragic. It's too much going on. <laughs> it's too, it's Bro, too are you a preacher? She got to keep saying that, huh? Am I a preacher? I'm just, uh, I'm, I don't know what I am. I'm a real nigga. That's the fuck I am. Look. In 2020. You're 22. Uh-huh. And you saying it's too much going on. Yeah. But not talking about pressure wise, like explain that. Like the, the fact that it's always too much going on. Too much going on meaning I got damn, okay, I gotta go work tomorrow. Um shit, let me just Decide if I want to go to bed or not. Like when I want to go to bed. Shit. All right. Damn. I'm, I'm about to. I'm about to. I'm about to play my my thought process. How I how I be in my head. Right. I'd be like. Yeah. <laughs> I'd be like yeah. I'm gonna get ready for work tomorrow or some shit. But damn, bro, am I gonna take a cold shower tomorrow? Or am I not gonna take a cold shower? Yeah, there is, nigga. Don't nobody wanna hear your fucking thought process. Damn, bro. Then I'll be sitting there debating and th- like start debating and finish it about if I'm gonna get in a fucking cold shower or not. But then I say to myself, I know when it's time. I'm the fucking go. Fuck you on your home. But just because I have these thoughts, so like said. everybody has their own thoughts and That's stuff. What she said. You saw me almost use the key to get out. I really just saw that shit though. That's the crazy part. But now nah, look, just because I got them thoughts, don't mean that I like take them serious. You know what I'm saying? Because it's not. It's only only thing I have control over. Well, I can have control over most things, but whatever happened next, you know what I'm saying? I can't control that. 
You know what I'm saying? I can't control that shit though. You feel me? But oh, that shit crazy, bro. This just really felt like yo. I just really felt like I was not being myself, bro. Like I was like I'm being myself, but I'm like sitting there like being awkward. The fuck is that, bro? Anyway, look. Back to the Adderall shit. Look. That that shit lit, bro. Like, motherfuckers be taking drugs and, like, using them for shit. Instead of taking the drug and what it, what it does for you and applying it to your real life. You feel what I'm saying? I don't know if I'm looking at the camera, bro. Apply it to your real fucking life, bro. I mean, and your, apply it to your sober life. Apply it to your sober life. Like, how you are when you sober, bro. You gotta stop being so uptight. You gotta stop being so, like, tight, bro. Loosen up, bro. Trust yourself. Trust your fucking self, man. This shit not even fucking hard. Just trust your fucking self, bro. Yeah, like... This you gotta understand too, motherfuckers gonna always have something to say. Like I say something about somebody too. Like I That's the problem. Motherfuckers don't wanna own up to that type of shit. Cause they like they scared they won't be perceived like something that they don't wanna be perceived by so they can get what they want. But bro, I motherfucking What do you say we just wrap this up and just pick this up tomorrow morning on the way to work?